size should be changed from here color should be changed from color palette as we are creating before now we should write some more text so select the text tool R duplicate the existence text so that will be more easy duplicating can be done in many methods in color draw but we are just going to edit menu and selecting duplicate for the next time we will be using shortcut key control D so that is duplicated we have to bring it at the very bottom and we have to size it a little bit small uh, like uh, this yes it's fine now we have to resize this U we have to move it like this to up to edit this text we should press F8 from our keyboard and select all the text and rewrite and rewrite our new text like uh, Taylor master yeah it's done now create one another rectangle of a small size in here define it a color as you wish so I'm going to define it a white color yeah it's fine so we have to create some more text deals in cloth of yes choose the fonts color it should be fine change the size to 12 bring it to the center now it's fine so we have to make it more effective with applying some transparency and we should not see this area but we should see only this area where we have the text so we are going here and selecting the interactive transparency tool and we just drag from here up to this level yes this is fine remove outline with right click on this icon now create a, a circle for ladies gents and children so I'm going to select ellipse tool for creating circles like this now we have to give it a pattern so to define a pattern or apply a pattern we go to one another dialog and that is fill the lock so press F11 now come down to presets and define any presets that is something uh, mage color with this card color it is okay now press OK duplicate this circle control D and color it as black and put it in the bottom of this first circle or behind of this first circle so we are going for this operation to arrange menu and selecting R and back one it's fine now we have to size it and we should create a shadow like effect Control G to group it. Now bring it here. 
and say it just make a duplicate of this text control D and take it down press F8 to edit ladies yeah ladies first and select this circle and press E to centralize now once again copy all the two objects and press ctrl D to make a duplicate once again ctrl D and thus we have done we have put it here like this and we have to put it here like this yes it's fine ladies gents and here we should define children the color should be very prominent according to the importance of these text in this visiting card so I'm going to define it a color that is um, something yellow and uh, we have to define it a shade to make it more prominent select drop shade and we have to define separate the shade for every of this Yeah, we have done almost half of the work. So take it up and to define one another rectangle and we should make uh, some more important effect for the address to define another rectangle on the same size but only at this area like this. It's okay. Like this now we should define a color similar to this visiting card color i think it should be moon green is fine convert it to the curve 